Let's open this up. I'm so excited. I love it. Hey guys, it's me, Jennifer Biana, and welcome to or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, please subscribe and like, comment, and all that jazz, and let me know what you think. And please click the notification bell to be notified every time I post. My socials will all be right here. I have not filmed a video in a what minute, Miss Girl. Not in a what what minute. But I have um, unfortunately been getting into more of my designer era. Um, unfortunately, because my bank account is crying at me. But I love a designer bag. Uh, one time I posted um, on my YouTube channel like my Louis Vuitton unboxing that I bought from Florence, Italy, and a lot of people liked it. So I was like, okay, I got another one. So let's get into it. Okay, so here is my designer hack if you really cannot afford designers. Actually, I'm lying, this is really not a hack because this requires more money, but if you happen to be going to Europe, <laughs> buy designer in Europe. I wasn't going to Europe recently, just it wasn't in my cards recently, but my parents were going to Europe, so they were going to Paris, and I was like, oh my God, get me this bag. Obviously, I paid for it because my parents would not be paying for that. Yeah, and it's like so much cheaper in Europe than it is in America. So if you know of anyone going to Europe that would be willing to do you a favor, get the bag there because I got this little Louis Vuitton bag in America. It costs a thousand eight hundred, thousand nine hundred. In Europe, it costs a thousand. Isn't that crazy? Oh. Isn't that wild? <laughs> so, you're a pack. <laughs> no, but I'm so happy my mom took time out of her trip to go into the Louis Vuitton store and get me this bag. I also do love Louis Vuitton because I think that they're more on the like affordable end of designers, but they're still cute. I know there's a lot of controversy about like if it's cheesy or not. I, as a Russian, <laughs> I love it. I love a little cheesy designer moment. Cause a lot of online is like, oh, if you wear flashy designer, then you're obviously broke. And like, you need to wear like understated like Prada or you can't even read the Prada. By the way, I love Prada. I like a Prada wallet. I love it, but like, I love a flashy moment. If you didn't see my first designer bag ever video, right here. And there I got a really understated Louis Vuitton. It's like a huge bag and it's like super understated and classy and like you can't even like in the light you can see it's Louis Vuitton. But like this, this is flashy AF. This is I'm here, Ms. girl look at me, bitch girl bag. This is my boot the house down bag. So let's get into it <laughs> without further ado. Let's open her up. I am so beyond excited. I don't have any like small little going out bags. So this was like, everything for me i wanted like a little cute little 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 cute little flex like a cute little going out flex so as you can see it comes in this little wrap or this little cloth and honestly i haven't really seen this like flashed around that much in america like i, don't, I just don't see a lot of people with this bag so are you ready these weren't so light and these were the same color as this but again i wanted to be like very obvious and flashy with this bag but like oh oh my god how beautiful i just don't think i've seen this bag that much isn't it so pretty and the color is just so neutral and beige and cute and girly but also like sleek you know like chic it's a girly and chic and I love that. It's a very like soft leather. Like it's so soft. Wait, let me show you guys. Like it is such a soft leather. Actually, I am really scared of messing up this bag. That is gonna be my biggest concern for the rest of time. Thank you. Um, but as you can see, like it is such a soft leather. Also is Louis Vuitton on this button. And I personally love like rectangular bags. I don't really love droopy, like like oval kind of bag. I love like a structure girl. So I was also surprised because I didn't know that it comes with all this stuff. Okay, so this is the inside of the bag. So obviously this is a chain. I am a silver girl, but I do still love gold sometimes, so it's fine. I like both. I, I definitely switch off. So this is the chain of the bag. Again, I do kind of wish it was silver, but it's fine so inside it's like very like felty 
the little, there's like some few folds and there's like a little pocket here. The reason I'm gonna sell you guys in this bag, the insides come out. So if you don't want all that nonsense, you don't have to have it, which I love because I kind of hate when bags have like a lot of like interior stuff because then I can't put like big bulky things in there and then I'm like annoyed. But um, as you can see, now it is like a fully empty bag with just like one pocket here. Um, and it just feels so nice in there. It is so freaking soft. So the insides, right? You have a little like card wallet here, which is really cute that they included that actually. So um, there's a big pocket here and there's little card slots, which again, I think is like really useful. And I love that it comes with that. And obviously here's his Louis Vuitton and it's the same leather as the outside. I would put like my cards here and obviously like cash would go in here. And it comes with this little pouch, which again, so freaking cute. It has the like embroidered and um, it opens up up top and zipper, like love the zipper. I don't really fully know what this part would be used for, but I guess it's just like another compartment in this bag. So you get like, two little inside wallets alongside this bag, which I actually think is really, 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 really nice. And it just slides right in. So yeah, that was my unboxing of my new Louis Vuitton. I am so excited. I think she is absolutely beautiful. I need a going out bag, that's what she is. And I tried to like be, like I always wear black. So I was like, finally, like, let me try and be like a little bit different this time. So yeah, let me know what you guys think. Would you get this bag? Do you think a thousand dollars is worth this bag? Definitely not a thousand eight hundred. I'll tell you that. Definitely not US coin. Definitely not, but a thousand like, in Paris, not that bad, I thought. But let me know, what do you think? All right, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Let me know if you have any other videos or anything you want to see from me. I love you guys. Bye.